Hey, this is Rob Houston. We're here at Meadow Lake Park where final preparations are being made for Saturday night's Christmas in the Park. It's one of four more reasons to visit Enid this week. Christmas in the Park returns Saturday night to Meadow Lake Park. This event is put on by the City of Enid Parks and Recreation Department, and there will be all kinds of goodies going on here at Meadow Lake Park, including games, crafts, there will be a lot of Christmas critters that will be wandering the area. There will be hot drinks and a lot more. So come on out. It's Saturday, 5 until 9 p.m. Christmas in the Park, Saturday night here at Meadow Lake Park. This weekend is the beginning of another Enid holiday tradition. It's the Living drive through Nativity going on at the Enid First Church of the Nazarene. This is the 32nd year for this activity that Enid First Naz is bringing to Enid and the area. Visitors will drive through a pathway of lights and witness firsthand the story of the first Christmas as portrayed in 10 different scenes. The story comes alive through beautiful music, scripture, and live animals. The show is Friday, Saturday, and Sunday nights, 6.30 until 8.30, and it is free admission. However, they will be accepting donations. It's the Living drive through Nativity this weekend at Enid First Church of the Nazarene. Gaslight Theater is getting into the Christmas spirit with its annual holiday show. This year's selection, A Christmas Story. You're all familiar with the story of humorous Gene Shepard's memoir of growing up in the Midwest in the 1940s following nine-year-old Ralphie Parker in his quest to get a genuine Red Ryder BB gun under the tree for Christmas. You're all familiar again with the exploding furnace, the leg lamp, the wet tongue on a cold lamp post, and much more. The show is also serving as a toy drive as Gaslight is inviting you to bring a new unwrapped toy for donation to the Garfield County DHS. The show runs Friday and Saturday night at 7.30 with the 2 p.m. Sunday matinee and the same times next weekend if it doesn't work for you to go this weekend. A Christmas Story put on by Gaslight Theater Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. A new event coming to Enid could be a very exciting time for the family. It is a family Christmas at Tea and Country Estate north of Enid. They are offering helicopter rides over downtown Enid, meaning you'll be able to go and see all of the things around the one bright lights and all of the activities, the ice skating rink, and you'll be able to see all of that from the air. They'll also have a helicopter candy drop, many Christmas lights, a petting area for the farm animals, hot cocoa, s'mores, live music, and much more. It is a $10 admission to attend, and it's going on Saturday and Sunday evenings from 6 until 11 p.m. A family Christmas at Tea and Country Estates, Saturday and Sunday nights. The Candy Cane Cash Final drawing is Tuesday night, so make sure you bring those tickets to the Chisholm Trail Expo Center. The Two Hip Chicks Road Show returns to the Chisholm Trail Expo Center Saturday 9 until 4. The Mid-American Nationals Wrestling Tournament brings teams from all over America to the Stride Bank Center Friday and Saturday. The finals will be Saturday at 5. And don't miss our other holiday activities, including the One Bright Lights, Holidays on Ice, also Christmas at the Farm, where you can cut your own Christmas tree down at Redbird Farm, the Leonardo's Night of Lights every Friday night, and a special thing has just been announced, the Christmas Drone Light Show. On Wednesday the 13th at 7 o'clock, go to the One Bright Lights for more information. And that's four more reasons to visit Enid this week. 
Again, we invite you here to Meadow Lake Park Saturday night for Christmas in the Park and all of the other holiday activities going on this week. For more information on all the events coming to Enid, go to our website, visitenid.org.